Hi everyone, this is Rosa Kelly. So today I'm here with the final walkthrough of my baby girl mini album. I love how this came out. I hope that you guys like it as well. So let's take a look. So hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone is doing good and hopefully staying busy and crafting during this quarantine so i am here with the final reveal of my baby girl mini album as you all know i am using my very first um, digital paper collection and i really love how it turned out i hope that you guys love it as well um, and over here on the front cover i'm using the beautiful baby girl from the ephemera piece actually this was from one of the sheets and i printed it out uh, larger so it can be nice and center on the front cover i do have some chipboard on the back and over here says my little angel and baby girl these are both stickers from michael's and they're dimensional stickers over here i have this beautiful pink rosette trim and this other white trim these are both from joanne's on the spine, I have another one of these beautiful baby girls that's just so pretty. And this is another set of stickers that I am using. And this is how the back looks like. And I will be adding my name in there. So let's take a look at the inside. By the way, I do have a tutorial on an 8 by 8 mini album. I will link it down below. And I do have the collection available on my website if you are interested I will also have the link down below okay so over here I created this pocket and inside the pocket we have a little mini journal I guess we can call it that it says sweet baby girl this is another one of the images and on the inside I am using my journaling pages that I created for this collection and I think this is so beautiful and so special because you can journal month to month how the baby starts changing. You can put the height, the weight, the funny moments that the baby has has had, you know, like the first little smile, the giggles, the messy food all over the face. You can put the milestones, like if the baby's sitting, it's walking, it's talking, you know, it's just so many cute things to journal because babies change so quickly. And then here it says a note from mommy, of course it can be from mommy or daddy, but I just didn't have all the room to put in there. And then you can add the picture. So this little booklet, um, I did a tutorial on my, the recent video that I posted um, embellishing this album. I did a little tutorial on how I created this little um, journal book so you have all of the months in here and i think it's just so sweet now this one tags right in there i wanted to create this as a separate piece so it's easy to take out and journal you can also take it out and take it with you and just brag about your baby <laughs> everywhere you go on the first page here this is my page that's always dedicated for when the baby is newborn um, so over here it opens up like that you can put the picture in there this sticker is left open and so you can slide your picture behind it. It says, welcome, baby girl. And I did add a beautiful flower in here. And this opens up like that. And it closes up with a magnet. I have all kinds of little trims in the album. Most of these trims came from Peru, like these little ones here. I usually stock up in laces every time I go visit my family and same thing with these ones the one on the front is from Joanne's here in the US okay so on the next page we have these adorable little bunnies this is another little sticker that says baby and here's where we start with the month to month so this is the first month over here so I have the first month bubble and this opens up like that and hopefully you can see the little baby girl um, paper design in there which i love i think it's so sweet and on this next page i have the little baby stroller and this opens up like that so for each one of my design pages i did like a main page and a complementary background so this is what this is here this will be from the main page and the background is just the smaller little babies and i went ahead and put some pearls on these little flowers from the paper and this opens up like this and lots of room for pictures. I wanted to include a little bit of uh, 
plain cardstock just in case you want to add a little bit of journaling in there as well and oh i didn't show you the pullout so each one of the pullouts i went ahead and stamp with a different stamp so i'll show you all of them and this is the trim that i told you so this is a fabric trim and this is a plastic trim right there so the first one says welcome baby and you can put the baby uh newborn picture in there this second one says babies are a bit of stardust blown from the hand of god and i think that's a beautiful sentiment i always use it on all my baby books on the next page we have the three months with this super sweet little baby and this opens up like that here is a three month bubble and when you open this up you can journal in here and i left this blank um, so you can just add pictures in there and then this ties with this pretty little ribbon here and when i decided when i designed the papers i already knew i wanted to include different elements on the pages so i went ahead and put the babies in the corner and did the little flowers a uh, little trim up and down in there and here's the four months combination of other papers so this is the background for this page as you can see and this opens up like that so i think it just everything flows really nice this is the next one it has the little baby footprints which are so cute and let's move on to the fifth month so over here it says five months baby is crawling and it says here i come and then this opens up two times and then here's the background there with the flowers and this little baby here is from the ephemera um page and i have this little rattle on a sticker set that is exactly the same size of the um, of the baby here so i just went ahead and glue it on top to give it give the rattle a little dimension and here's the six months bubble and this opens up like that and then this is another background just like the flowers here just to scale down a little bit more and the sweet baby i didn't love that one and this closes up like that and here's the next insert this one says a baby fills our hearts with love and that goes in right there so extra room for pictures over here is the seven months and i had to include a ducky page because duckies are my daughter's favorite thing ever and i just think it's really sweet when we include babies of in the pictures of the baby on the bathtub they're just the most adorable pictures ever and see over here it says make a splash and here's the seven months bubble that is also left open so we can put a picture in the back and this opens up like this and so the background page for this one will have the duckies and then room for picture on the on the center and then over here i complement it with another cardstock piece but i did put a little trim of the duckies in there as well and here's the eight months with the baby, bigger baby crawling more of this little trim and this just opens up like that lots of room for pictures and look at the little babies on this one it says i wish you faith that is strong joyful hope joyful hope for the future and a lifetime full of love so i thought it was a beautiful beautiful sentiment for babies too and on the next one the nine months i am using the moon baby again and the beautiful moon page background and over here says love you to the moon and back and this is from the ephemera page and here's a nine month bubble and this is just a little waterfall that you can put um, three by five pictures in there and the next page here i did use a dimensional sticker with these little owls these little owls are the same sticker sets from the baby girl here on the front cover and here's the 10 months and you can of course put the picture of the baby right up here and this opens up and here is a large pocket with more of the moon background page i, I really love this one and i just put a little um, sticker here this says it's a girl but you can fit all kinds of pictures in there as well and even put a picture here and on this page it says love you to the moon and back because there's so many moons on this page i thought it was really cute 
so that just goes right in there and the last two these actually turned out to be my favorite i wasn't sure because of the blue but i think it's just so sweet to have the combination of the little baby blue and pink and it's such a girly light blue also so i love it and here we have of course the baby that is a little bit bigger standing up it says you are so beautiful and this is a sticker it says so sweet and here's the 11 months and then when we open this up we have these adorable little bunnies for the background and on the 12 month page of course i always want to include a lot of room on the 12 months because the baby is just like bigger and turned one year old so you wanted to take all kinds of pictures so i created this little booklet here this is left open in the corner so you can add your picture right there hopefully not too large so you can still see some of the bunnies and when you open it up you have all kinds of room to add a lot of pictures in there this page over here says laughs and giggles and another sweet little baby playing and then you open this up and here's the baby she's my favorite so i had to use it a few times and then over here you can add a picture and this opens up and we have a lot of room for pictures on this um, page as well so that is the baby book i hope that you guys like it i i love it i love making baby books and every time i make a baby book it's different so it's always like a little surprise i think i just i just had so much fun making it so i hope that you guys enjoy the walkthrough of this book i also do offer blank mini albums on my website if you just want to decorate your album and not having to make it from scratch um so yeah so i'm gonna have my website link down below and i hope that who is getting this book really really likes it and i want to thank you all so much for watching i'll see you on the next video Bye bye